Hello everyone, this is Susie Q, Susie Q's Happy Little Haven, and welcome to my nursery room window. Today I have two of my uh, favorite baby dolls with me. Um, the first one uh, you'll notice in the background uh, waving is my Maggie Mae, and uh, then who I'm holding is Anthony Michael. Anthony Michael is my uh, newest baby from Emma Bennett. Um, they've both been reborn by Emma Bennett. And I love both of them so much. I want to change Maggie Mae today um, into a dress that I really like. And I want to do that before um, before the, the warmer weather gets here. And so um, I'll show you that in just a second. But I wanted to show you, I never did uh, put this outfit on Anthony Michael and show you um, what it looked like on him. And Emma also, um, she knits outfits for all of her babies that she sells. And this is an outfit that she specially um, knitted for Anthony Michael. Um, and so here's a cute little hat. It's got, um, on the side, it's, it's got the little ear muffs, the little ear things on the side. Got a little pom-pom on the, on, the, um, on the back. It's got two little pom-poms in the front um, of the sweater. And then it came with these matching um, and coordinating little diaper covers. So um, I wanted to bring him on again because I haven't done a details video of Anthony Michael, which I need to do, uh, and I will be doing that soon. Um, but I wanted to bring Maggie May on again. Um, like I said, I wanted to put her in a dress that is really special and looks really pretty on her. So anyway, uh, let me go ahead and put little Anthony Michael uh, down back in his little bed, and I will be back in just a second to show you the dress that I want to put on Maggie Mae. And this is it. You might recognize this from uh, from the fall. Um, last last fall, Suzanne uh, of Suzanne's Babies has sent this for. Uh, Maggie May, and I just love it. It's corduroy, and it's in that mustard color. And um, I wanted to get that, uh, put this on her one more time before the weather gets too warm for it, because it's long sleeve, it's corduroy, and um, she also sent these coordinating little knit, cable knit, um, little tights, and these cute, 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 cute little suede shoes. That have little ears on them. Little puppy dog. I think these are puppy dog ears. So, um, and then what I, the, the bows that I've chosen for her are these gold shiny bows. So yeah, I'm really excited to get her back in the stress again. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Um, Maggie Mae is waving hello to everyone. Um, she's excited to be back on video and to say hi to all her um, aunties and uncles. So, and she's got her little um, her little unicorn with her today. Um, Sharon from Sharon and Mae's channel had sent this for Maggie Mae um, a while back. And she, she kind of switches in between having the, the unicorn and then having this little, um, tiny little baby doll. And so today she chose to have the unicorn with her today. So we'll put the baby doll back in her, um, in her toy box. And let's go ahead and get her outfit changed out. And I am going to have a really fun day today. Today is the day that, um, my husband and I put together the wardrobe closet that I uh, told you about in my last video. And um, it came uh, two days ago. Um, and it, um, but yesterday we were gone all day. And so, um, of course, we didn't get a chance to, uh, you know, to open the box and to get into it and to put it together. But today's the day that we're going to do that. And I'm going to be, uh, after it's all put together, I am going to be um, rearranging my baby clothes, my zero to three months and my newborn clothes uh, into these cabinets. And then after, after I get everything said and done, um, I am going to do a nursery tour and I'll show you 
the end result of all my organizing. And it's going to be so nice to be able to have one whole wardrobe for zero to three months and then one whole wardrobe for newborn um, because I have a lot of clothes for my girls um, in those two sizes. And I was totally running out of space trying to fit all of that into one wardrobe closet. So this will give me a chance to get everything separated out and, um, you know, and be able to, you know, reorganize so that when I open the cupboard door, I can just look inside and see what I have. Um, I can see what I have right now, but everything is kind of smashed together in there. You know how that is if you've got too many things in a closet and you just can't push the hangers from side to side. Well, that's what's happening now. In fact, I don't even have room for some tutu outfits and other things that I have gotten for my um, for my my newest elf doll, uh, Luna, and some of my other dolls. And so I thought it was time. <laughs> It was time for me to get one more wardrobe closet and um, in my nursery I can fit one more and that's it and then I'm totally out of space so um, in a way the way that my nursery is set, set up it's very um, self-limiting as to um, how you know how many outfits that I can have for my babies and right now I feel like I'm just at the perfect amount I just needed a little bit more space to organize everything so yeah cute girl I haven't had her on in a bit and um, I've been wanting to bring her back on and I just love her little happy smiling face just every time I look at her she's just wow she's amazing um, her artist did an amazing realistic job with uh, reborning her rooting her hair um, she's got human hair she's got rooted human uh, hair eyelashes and um, she's just gorgeous and I have her along with a lot of other uh, a lot a lot of my other babies um, in you know set up in my living room so that I can see her every day her and um, oh just a whole a whole bunch I should give you a when I do my nursery tour I'm going to show you my couch babies <laughs> that's what I'll do I'll show you my couch babies too and you'll see who I have um, on my couch and um, you'll see uh, Katie Lynn, um, she's the Yannick sculpt that is her, um, Maggie Mae's little sister. Uh, she's all, she's in a rocking chair that's sitting right besides um, Maggie Mae. Okay, so let's go ahead and get her tights on first because this is usually the most challenging part of getting Maggie Mae dressed up. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> and uh, I love that she's always laughing at me when I'm trying to get her dressed up because she's very, very patient, but she also laughs and giggles and has such fun, you know, at me struggling to get tights on because uh, <laughs> tights are hard and uh, to do. But, you know, when I get, when I finally get them on, it's just um, that she looks so cute in them. So. I'm going to put up with the challenge in order for her to look like a little cutie patootie. So yeah, yesterday was our our every three week um, grocery shopping day. We went into town. Um, we had a doctor's appointment first, um, and due to some mix-ups in the doctor's office, we were there for two and a half hours. Uh, for an appointment that should have taken no longer than, oh, I would say 15 minutes. <laughs> so we were there really, really late. Um, and what we, you know, and then after that, we were supposed to get our, our grocery shopping done. So we didn't get out of there till we had a 12 15 appointment and we didn't get out of there until close to, to it was like 2 30. We finally got out. So, um, but anyway, we got everything resolved, and uh, then we went to our stores. Um, we, we had to go to, we, we go to several stores when we go shopping, um, because 
there's several stores that we need, you know, different supplies from. Uh, let's see, we went to Tractor Supply, which is a place where they sell farm, farm th um, tools and feed and um, things like that. And uh, so that's where I get my my uh, bunny food for Benji. He's my my uh, two year old bunny. Got a couple. Of, got him a couple of years ago. I get his food and his litter there for his litter box. And so yesterday I needed to get his litter. And so we went there. And then we went to, after that we went to Dollar Tree. And um, Dollar Tree, I get, a, I get a few things there at Dollar Tree. Um, but, you know, you got to watch out for Dollar Tree because sometimes things aren't um, as cheap as you think they are. Like, for example, um, my husband had, like, I like to buy uh, canned, you know, just to be quick about it sometimes, I like to buy canned mushrooms, sliced mushrooms. And uh, so when we were in Dollar Tree, my husband said, oh, do you need mushrooms? And um, I said, yeah, I do, but I am going to be getting them from um, Aldi because Aldi has such good prices. We, we shop according to prices, you know, like what store has the best price. So anyway, um, he said, are you sure? They're only a dollar here. And I said, um, he, he said, are, you know, are they cheaper at Aldi? And I said, oh yeah, they're much cheaper at Aldi. I go, these, these are a dollar a jar. And so anyway, we went, um, when we ended up going to Aldi for a lot of our food items yesterday, um, I showed him the price on the mushrooms and they were only, I think it was 49 cents for the same size. So he just, you know, he couldn't believe it. Uh, it's just, you got to be careful because Dollar Tree has a lot of neat stuff, but sometimes um, their sizes aren't comparable. They're more expensive than getting uh, the same size at another store. So we have, so we go to Walmart. Uh, Aldi and um, Dollar Tree mainly and then we sometimes will if uh, Kroger is having a sale especially they have some really good sales on meat and uh, so we'll go to Kroger too but we didn't need to go to Kroger yesterday thank heavens because we were so late getting out of the doctor's office um, we did end up going to Panera Bread for our lunch and um and gosh we were there i think we got there about five o'clock or something it was really late and see we live about an hour a little over an hour away from the city so um but anyway you know we were done with our shopping we were able to relax and uh have our lunch or I guess, I don't know what you would call it at that time, probably dinner. <laughs> uh, so we had our dinner and uh, my husband and had, I had our usual um, sourdough soup bowls of, um, let's see, it's the broccoli cheddar, broccoli cheddar cheese soup. And boy, did it hit the spot because usually when we go shopping, all I have in the morning is coffee because I, I don't want to eat like a protein bar or something because I don't want to be too full for the lunch that we had. Well, I didn't, nobody of course realized that we were going to be that long at the doctor's office. So, um, I was really hungry by the time we had our, our lunch or dinner. And so, um, it was especially good last night. And again, we had our apples alongside our soup. And um, boy, that's such a refreshing fruit to have alongside that kind of a soup. Because the soup is, is really super good, but it's also really rich. And um, so it's kind of like a, a refreshing taste afterwards. Boy, this dress has buttons all the way down. Yeah, it makes it so easy, though, to put on her um, Maggie Mae. So there we have it. Get that all done. Oh, she's so cute. Love her in this color. 
she looks good in a lot of colors. Um, this is especially pretty on her because she has such a sunshiny face. And so she just glows when she's in this color of yellow. It's because it's such a um, cheery yellow. Sort of like a, I always never know what to call this yellow. But I like the color of it. Okay, let's go ahead and put her shoes on. Get her back here so you can watch that process. And then last but not least, we will put her uh, pretty little gold bows on. These shoes are so darling. They go with a lot of outfits um, for Maggie Mae. And look at the bottom. They have It has stars on the bottom. I just think these are so cute, Suzanne. So go ahead and put this one on. So yeah, I'm looking forward to doing our little project this morning. Um, after my husband has his breakfast, we're going to come into the nursery and put our the wardrobe together. Then I can get all organized and then I can have my nursery tour and um, start the new year out right. You know, another thing that I needed to do with Maggie Mae is I needed to get her some earrings and I have her earrings down here. Um, I think I'm going to use sparkly ones and we have some hearts that are like a yellow color that have the little rhinestones in them. Well, they're, they're actually Shabarsky crystals, I guess. Um, but here they are. And uh, you won't be able to tell the color, but they're what they are is the, um, they're the yellow like in the, the dress here. So we're gonna take these out, which are pink. These are really pretty. The pink ones and I am going to put her little yellow hearts these are little yellow hearts all sparkly just perfect for her sparkly little personality yeah make sure I put the um, <laughs> the earrings down in a safe place so I don't lose them on the dressing table there we go there we go oh she looks cute in hearts Okay, now I was just going to comb her hair. I'm not going to take her braids out. Her braids are in really good shape. Just want to give her little, her hair a good little comb. And I do like to use a comb with her hair because uh, uh, for her hair, it's, it's much more gentler. I rarely use a brush unless I really have to because I, I tend to find that if I use a brush, um, it kind of pulls out um, the hair at times. So we do it this way. Okay. Oh, I love that color on her. So there we go. We'll put her bows in. Really a perfect color for this outfit. Her cute little bows. I really like her hair like this. This this is my favorite. This summer I'll be putting her when I, the weather gets hotter. I'll be putting her up um, two little piggy tails, which is my favorite look in the summertime. But let me lift this up a bit. There we go. Okay, there she is, and here's her unicorn. Look at that. The gold little horn and the unicorn um, matches up with the bows. Are you kidding me? <laughs> didn't know that but it's always fun when that works out isn't it okay so I think that we are done with Maggie Mae and um, so I want to bring back Mr. Anthony Michael so that we can say goodbye to him I just love this little guy um, Maggie Mae loves her new little brother too she is um, she, she's always happy when she gets a new sibling of course, she's happy about everything. <laughs> uh, anyway, everyone, um, I hope you're having a great day today. It's Wednesday, um, middle of the week. And um, have a, a wonderful rest of your week. And thanks for joining me today. And I will see you in the next video, which should be my nursery tour. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.